Whoa. Okay, I shouldn't have done that. Um, <laughs> morning. It's, I don't know, 7 or 8 a.m. We're going to have, this is a terrible angle. We're going to do eggs this morning. I got three eggs here. And I'm going to do three egg whites and one yolk. Riveting content, really. Mm. Having a monster today. Yeah, so doing those eggs, I'm gonna toast up this bun that I made. I don't have any, oh, I do have normal tomatoes. Let me slice a normal tomato. Mmm, actually, cherry tomatoes are so yummy. I'm gonna do cherry tomatoes. I got this um, tikka masala mayonnaise. So we'll see how it is. I'm just reading the ingredients. Tika spices. That drives me crazy. Like, obviously spices, but which spices? Like, that matters. Whatever. So, yeah. And I got some chews. There's Finny Winnie yelling at me. Here's Mama Cat taunting him through the window. Hi, Finn. You already were in the house this morning. Hi. Poor Finn. He just wants to be an inside cat. I don't know where the other cats are. Oh, there's a fluffy boy. Hi, the fluffy boy. Hi, Mr. Floof. <laughs> it's working. I'm going to come out there as soon as I'm done with breakfast. You're so cute. Voila. Bone apple tea. What a good boy. Well, I just got back. We have a couple visitors here who needed some blood work done. So instead of taking them into town and like risking be around, being around people, um, I just got the tubes. I had the lab send us the tubes with Clement and drew their blood myself and sent them back just now. So that was kind of a nice outing. I mean, not really. I walked across the center. Woo! But yeah, so now I'm just going to do something. Finn is inside again. He's being stalked by Fluffy Boy. Yeah. Mom is a little apprehensive.
You fell. Rubbing your mouth on my glasses. I love you too, buddy. Ew, you drooled on my shirt. Why'd you drool on my shirt? I love you. You're the cutest boy of them all. on my arm. Oh, okay, okay, Finn. Okay, Finn. Bye, that was precious. So for lunch, I have some multi-grain tortilla chips. I melted some cheese and I have some salsa. Very okay lunch. Yeah, so uh, these are the tortilla chips. Good source of fiber. Woo, they're pretty good. Well, I took a two hour nap and woke up at like quarter till four. Now it's almost five. I'm still tired, but I'm also hungry, excuse me. I'm very hungry. Those chips weren't super filling. Yeah, I am headed to Auntie Linda's house. They have also been social distancing slash quarantining and washing their hands very often. Um, they're having pad thai over there, so that'll be what's for dinner. It's what's for dinner! Isn't that a thing? Where did that... It's what's for dinner. Where is that from? I don't know. But yeah, so I'm excited. I'm gonna do a veggie pad thai. Everyone else is having chicken pad thai. I'm going to put some paneer in it. Um, paneer is a type of cheese that they use in Indian dishes a lot. So I'm excited. It's going to be yummy, yummy, yummy. And I love peanuts. Like pad thai usually has a peanut based sauce, or at least how we make it. It started raining, so I'm rolling up the windows and my car does not have air con. So it's gonna be a little toasty, but that's okay. Alright, off we go. Off we go into the wild blue yonder. Do, 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 do. I'm glad I left when I did. It would have like it's definitely going to start pouring even harder soon.
this has been a very strange rainy season. Um, when I got back from Christmas, it was, I don't know, like middle of June-ish. I think I left America at like, June, or not June, January. I left America January 7th, so like, yeah, mid-June. It really didn't rain a whole lot until like end of February-ish. Like usually, or at least, you know, I've only been here for one other rainy season, but last rainy season and what I've t been told by other people is that a lot of the time there's like afternoon storms pretty much all January through February, and we really haven't had that up until this month and we're approaching the end of March, which, weird, so, yeah, we definitely have not got enough rain this rainy season, um, they did say Kariba Dam was, I think, like, 60% filled, so we're definitely gonna be having load shedding again this dry season, but, honestly, they've still been load shedding on the Rivendale side of the farm, like, Cafacumba area hasn't been load shedding, but the Rivendell side has been having load shedding, and, but no, none of the towns, like Adola and Atue both stopped load shedding, so it doesn't really make sense that they're load shedding in the middle of nowhere, so, um, that's, I don't know, take it for what you will. I'm rambling. Anywho, going to Auntie Linda's for dinner. Still social distancing, being careful. No one there has been doing anything crazy either, so should be fine. Amber's gonna be there, so she's if she's comfortable with it, then I'm comfortable with it. Um, so yeah, this is gonna be annoying to edit because I'm so rambly. Anywho, love you, Sam. Um, I'll do a quick picture of dinner. I probably won't vlog because that would mean telling people I'm vlogging and then they'll, then they'll go watch my videos and I don't want that because that's weird. Just you, only you Sam and Mark Sturdy. He also follows my YouTube channel. So just my two cousins. All right. See you later. Oh, hello, Harvey, Charlie girl. GG, why are you run? Why are you shaking everywhere? <gasps> Is that Tobby? Hi, Tobby. Oh yes, what a good boy. Char Char, calm down. <laughs> she hasn't grown much. She might stay this little. She's just a puppy. You're just a puppy. We got her in like well, not we. I helped pick her out in November. Toby. Gia is my favorite. She has weekend sleepovers with me sometimes for fun. She wants to go inside. I don't think you're allowed inside. We got chicken pad thai going. This is the paneer. Cheese. Peanut sauce. Wow. It's like 9 p.m. now. And I'm home and in bed, obviously. Anywho, that was my day. Colton and I played real hard and I am exhausted. Children are exhausting, but he's so cute. He calls me Aunt Meow. We didn't even teach him that. Like, he was calling me Aunt Rain and then he decided my new name was Aunt Meow, which is just absolutely adorable. So, well, I hope you enjoyed this, Sam. And Mark, if you watch it, love you. Mwah.